beard. Alright, welcome back to All For Taste. Uh, today, we have another canned beer. I've had like, I think the last four or five I've had were all cans. But uh, this is the uh, Kentucky IPA from the Kentucky Brewing Company. Um, let's see, it says, oh, I'm sorry, not Kentucky, I'm sorry. The Altex Lexington Brewing Company. Lexington's in Kentucky, so. Mm. Anyway, it says, uh, Kentucky IPA is deliciously hoppy, golden-hued American IPA. It has a bright citrus flavors and sweet floral aromas. Which come from the liberal dry hopping with American hops. Uh, yep. So I looked it up to see what kind of hops they got. They're uh, using Cascade and Columbus. Um, and then they're dry hopping with Sentinel and Simcoe. So that ought to be pretty good. Uh, 6.5%. And in 2014, it won the, uh, the Beverage Tasting Institute's Silver. So anyway, just some, some useless facts there. Uh, what else we got here? This is a 16 ounce can. It says Lexington's oldest brewery. So, all right, cool, uh, cool can. It's got a nice little horse head on the front. So, there we go. All right, let's go ahead and pop this thing. All right. Let's pour it all up in there. All right. How much we head? Let's go ahead and see if we can get a head up on it. Not a, not a huge head for an IPA. Yeah, not not too much of a head. It was uh, maybe I don't know, maybe a quarter of a finger, and now it's gone down to nothing really, really fast. So kind of disappoint, disappointed in the head there. I hate when you can't get enough head. Right, baby? Okay. So yeah, the color is a, uh, a slight honeyish color. A little bit of carbonation coming up from the bottom, but not a whole bunch. Um, as far as I know, this is a fresh can. Of course, it doesn't have a date anywhere. I haven't looked on the bottom. I don't see a date anywhere, so there's no way to... Oh, take that back. There's something stamped here. But, of course, there's a big ding right there. It says, oh... Ah, there's no way to tell what that is. So, anyway, let's go ahead and uh, put a nose up on it. Ooh, orange peel. I mean, you get the orange peel first thing. Slight piney smell. A little floral too. Getting some uh, some grassy notes in there. All right, let's go ahead and uh, put a tongue up on this and drink it. That's pretty good. You know, you get the, the pine first. Some of the pine, a little bit grassy there at the front. Um, but you do get some like an orange peel taste up in there. Not a whole heck of a bunch because the uh, like the malty taste kind of I mean, it goes right from bitter the hops into the malty, so it's yeah, it mellowed out pretty good. Well, that's balanced out pretty good. Like I said, it does hit you at first with the pine and that the orange peel, but then goes right into a like a sweet malty taste. Well, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Definitely a drinkable one, but at 6.5, um, I wouldn't drink a lot of them because it'll hit you, but uh, yeah, oh, air's coming out. But uh, yeah, not too bad. Kentucky IPA from the, what I, what I call the All Tech Lexington Brewery out of Lexington, Kentucky. Um, yeah, so there you go. Anyway, peace. Pretty good.